Francois Bozizé is staging a comeback. The former president of the Central African Republic is back in the spotlight ahead of the country's presidential poll, slated for October. Bozizé was toppled in March 2013, unleashing a wave of ethnic attacks that killed thousands and displaced many more. Today, though, bolstered by a nomination from his Kwa Na Kwa party, he insists his return to politics is vital for the country's recovery. Because the problem begin with me and I leave the country, I must come to discuss together with my rivals and you choose the solution of our country and the country go on. Why uh, they, they put me out? No, it's not the problem. Speaking from his refuge in Uganda, Bozize says he's confident of winning the election. But my rival are very afraid to see me between them for the, the election because I will win in the first uh, time, not uh, the second. I know. All over in the country knows it. It's the population who call me. Because when I leave the country, after me, the situation is very, very bad. The government that succeeded Bozize issued an international warrant for his arrest in 2013, accusing him of crimes against humanity and incitement to genocide. Now he faces United Nations travel and banking sanctions. The African Union fears his return will undermine peace efforts and destabilize the country and says it does not support his return. For now, though, Bozize seems defiant and determined to win. Clementine Logan, CCTV.